Mr. Heavy Chevy here. I got a little two quart Dutch oven pan. It's got a little rust in it. Bought this thing at a yard sale somewhere. It's just a made in Taiwan one. I like to clean it up and see how it works. I'm going to clean it up, get the rust off it using electrolysis. I've just got three old scrap pieces of steel plate and some rod bolts out of an old 396 I heated up and bent over and welded on there and I've got uh, some wires hooking all three together <clears throat> it's just a bucket of water and you mix in some Arm & Hammer washing soda mix it up hook your battery charger to this post the positive terminal and then you hook your negative to the piece you're gonna de-rust and uh, pretty soon bubbles will start forming and after a few hours the rust will be gone pretty pretty slick I'll uh, set this up and then uh, show you while it's in there de-rusting all right now I've got the the uh, little Dutch oven inside there you can see that sort of there and uh, you gotta be careful it doesn't touch the steel plates that the positive lead is hooked to and you just hook the negative lead to the piece you're being rusting. I'm gonna go ahead and turn the charger on you and see what it starts doing here. It starts making little white bubbles and you can see it going towards those steel plates. The rust and I can't explain the uh, chemical process but it'll take the rust off it you just clean up with some with a stainless steel wire brush after you're through and it'll be uh, no rust at all on it all right I pulled it out of the electrolysis bucket and you can see where the rust is kind of turned black where the pitting was and I've hit it with a water wheel a little bit right there it cleans up very quickly you know, just sit there sucking rust dust. I'll clean it up some more and show you that. Alright, I got it pretty clean with the uh, water wheel. It took me about a minute and a half. The outside cleaned up good. Now it's ready to season. In whatever manner you choose to use. I do mine over the wood fire. That's it for now. See ya.